Hey people, I want to talk about an app right here called Truckee. And this is for people who use both Euro Truck Simulator 2 and American Truck Simulator. If you're going to use this app, there's only one way this thing will actually work correctly. And I'm going to explain to you. I have tested this and tested this and scratched my head. And I'm going to show you the correct way of launching this. So first thing you want to do is click on the Truckee app, which you can download from online. Okay, so what you're going to do is minimize that. Next thing you're going to do, don't go to your trucks. Go to Steam. This is the really important part. Go to Steam and start it. Okay, so Steam is now loaded. So we're going to close this little splash box and we are going to close. Don't minimize. You can just close it completely. So now the only thing you got running is the Truckee app. Now, what do you do? You go over here to your bottom right hand corner where your TSRs are. It's called Terminate and Save Resident, meaning it's not running active, although this Truckee is. Steam is not. Ignore this one. So, Terminate and Save Resident, TSR. So, you're going to go down here, and right here is your Steam icon. Just click on it. Left, right, it doesn't matter. Click on it, and then go to your simulator, American Truck Simulator from me, and let it load. The next thing you know is you'll see this here. Now, a lot of times you'll see this regardless of how you do it. And then go in. I actually have different profiles. This is my baby profile here. Okay, so I paused the game here after I got loaded in so I can show you. Now, whenever you pause it, you're not going to see the splash screen. But I'm already currently in route. I'm just kind of stopped here because I wanted to make this video. So, you'll come in here and you'll see. Now, I have mine faded out. What you can do is hit Control Tab. And now, you can move your mouse around your screen to be able to click on the various uh, things that might pop up. If you have a friends window right here that pops up, use the control tab and then to get to this point use your mouse left click and drag and you can drag it out the way. You can reset up everything. See like this right here? You can move all this stuff around. Um, I'm going to put it back here because I want it back where I had it. And then once you're done Hit Control Tab again, and now you're back in the game. Um, if you hit Alt Tab, you'll be back over here. You can go down here to Settings and click whatever you need up in here. You also have Customize, and you can scroll through and turn on and off different things down through here customize it even more including um where was that at window transparency the one where I showed you where mine is faded out I have it at 0 0.5 I think by default it's at 0 0.75 I think and then lastly there's other settings where you can come in and do things as well there's a few things make sure that you save each time like that and you are good to go so that's how to properly properly launch let me pause this again uh, that's how you properly launch American Truck Simulator with truck with the Truckee app so that you get credit now I'm going to control tab again now you'll know it's working when you pick up a load and right up here in this right hand corner you'll get a little text message in a box and it'll talk about the load and the uh, uh, the number that is associated with that particular load will show up here also when you deliver your load you'll get a little pop-up message right here saying that it has been delivered and been uh, sent to your Truckee app to be recorded okay so we'll come over here and we'll go to game summary and right now since I just restarted I have zero jobs but you can look up into here you can also go to profile 
and scroll down and see all the jobs that you've done the dates and everything how many miles all the pertinent now this red right here it says racing miles that's because i was rushing on both of those i was getting tired i just wanted to get it there i got the credit but it shows up in red but this is where you can see that and then of course in the vt hub you can go to jobs and categories and you can go way up into detail which i'm not going to so that is how you properly launch uh, a, a truck simulator with the app.